so it's unsafe for residents to be here. So they're going around on this ATV, ordering them all out now. Even though our flight down here was two and a half hours, our stay here has been very brief, just about 15 minutes, enough time to unload everything and then get some more supplies back in. Now we're headed back up to Cleveland. Scott, boy, it was an amazing night here. As a matter of fact, the party is still going on behind me here at the House of Blues in downtown Cleveland. Hundreds of people are packed in there trying to hear the latest blues acts in town and, of course, trying to catch a star or two. Hi, Scott and Lydia. I want you to check this out. This is so cool. Look at this. This is the Manhattan Safe armored car, and boom, there has been a big explosion here in the side. Obviously, some dastardly criminal trying to get in there, steal the money out. This is one of the props that's being used here for the filming of Spider-Man 3 in downtown Cleveland. And tonight, you, the public, are invited to come on down Boyd in for Kim Wheeler. And good morning, I'm Jeff Maynard. We're glad you're with us for Channel 3 today, Saturday morning, which starts right now. Look, there's Jack O'Lantern. Ooh, the great pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> it was so nice to see a bit of that sunshine streaming through the Channel 3 windows this morning. Yeah, it's been a little, little scarce lately. We'll find out uh, what the weather's going to be like for this weekend and ahead for the trick-or-treaters from A.J. Colby. Well, hope police are investigating after a Lakewood teen is attacked and sexually assaulted while walking home from a high school football game. The 14-year-old victim shared her terrifying story with our Bill Saffos, saying it's her way of fighting back. That newborn left in a trash can at Tower City is getting a new home. Baby Jack is leaving Metro Health Medical Center to live with a foster family in the greater Cleveland area. A maintenance worker found the infant early last week when she was cleaning a restroom in Tower City Center downtown. Doctors say baby Jack was probably in the trash can for about three hours. They say he was dangerously cold and having seizures when he arrived at the hospital. Police are still searching for Jack's mother. They believe she's likely a black young woman. Police are also trying to enhance surveillance tapes to get a better look at her. Much more coming up this Saturday morning on Channel 3, lowering the number of... <laughs> what the heck was that? <laughs> it's a jelly bean dispenser, yeah, AJ. It's jelly beans. Yes, Spitz it does. It's a kitty. <laughs> That, uh, with a litter, of, uh, with kitty litter, you know, jelly beans come out of the come out of the cat. We also have the oh dear one, just <laughs> hey, in that, time for the Christmas great. season. That's it. We'll see you at uh, oh, twelve yeah. noon and again tomorrow morning, nine o'clock. <laughs>